Hi guys, hello, my name is Joy. I am the owner and CEO of PrintedBonnet.com. Uh, we make primarily five different products, shower bonnets, hair bonnets, the sleep bonnets, um, deep conditioning bonnets, turbans, and scrunchies. Um, these are the five main products we make. Our products are geared towards men and women of all ages, um, and regardless of your hair type and sizes. Now I'm gonna be answering over the next few weeks some of the questions we've received about our products. So I wanna make sure that everyone is aware of what we do and why we do it. So just a little bit of history. Um, I have always been very handy. I, I love to sew, crochet, and knit. It's just my thing. I also teach sewing. So if you haven't done so, you can check out our site at isewithjoy.com. I enjoy interacting with people and this is one of the ways I do that as well, um, making hair bonnets to help keep our hair healthy and strong. So um, I started sewing hair bonnets approximately four years ago uh, when my daughter actually, she saw one of the bonnets I had and she suggested, she's like, mom, why don't you just make that and sell it? And I was like, I don't know about that, kids. If you know our history, we started out as a baby wear um, company. So that was pretty much where I was focused. And I made one and it sold and I made 10 and they sold and I started making more and word of mouth just got out and it started to sell more and more. Um, and to date we have sold quite a bit of hair and shower bonnets, uh, sleep bonnets and that it was all thanks to my now nine year old who um, asked, you know, why don't you, why don't you try it? So I did and here we are many years later. Anyways, um, so today I'm gonna be actually be focusing on some of the questions I've gotten about our shower bonnets because that seems to be the hottest seller. So I figured, hey, why not mention it or bring it up? So I'm just gonna go over the five main questions I've received in the past about our shower bonnet. So um, I received some questions about what exactly is a shower bonnet because believe it or not, not everybody wears a shower bonnet, which is, you know, for someone with natural hair, I'm like, wait, what? But honestly, that's true. Not everyone wears a shower bonnet. And it's not based on the color of your skin. It's just not everyone feels the need to wear it. Some people like to go in the shower and not, you know, they, they know how to take a shower and not get their hair wet. I am not one of those people. So if I don't have a shower bonnet on, you best believe I'll be coming out of that shower um, stall with wet, the wet hair. So a shower bonnet is basically a hair, a waterproof hair covering that ensures that your hair stays dry either while you're taking a shower, putting on your makeup, painting around your house, whatever you're doing. It's just a waterproof cap that covers your hair. Um, it's not to be confused with our deep conditioning bonnet, which also covers your hair, but is used for a different purpose and also not to be confused with our sleep bonnets, which are used primarily when you sleep. Our shower bonnets do not come with satin lining. We do make some custom ones for, for customers who ask specifically for bonnets that have the, shower, um, the satin lining. All right, so here's a little bit. Um, the next question I've received is how do shower caps work? Like I mentioned earlier, they are waterproof, so they keep your hair dry while you take a shower or do other things like doing your makeup. So sometimes when you're doing makeup, and I don't wear a lot of makeup, so um, when you're doing your makeup, but I've seen enough videos to know that some people, you know, you put on the foundation, you put on other things for your skin, you might not want it to get on your hair. You know, good way to keep it away from your hair is to put on your shower cap or, um, you know, just, or you can put your hair back up in a clip, but you know, clip it back up, but a shower bonnet will help with that. Also, another thing is, if let's say you're painting around your house and you don't want, an accident to happen with paint falling on your hair. Again, that is another reason why you would go with a shower bonnet as opposed to a sleep bonnet because a sleep bonnet might get ruined and you're not going to be able to use it again in the future. Now, uh, so the next question I got is, uh, can I use a shower cap for swimming or shower bonnet? Absolutely not. Uh, the ones that are made for swimming are made with silicone and it also has the materials that keeps it very close to your hair so it doesn't allow for much water to get in, um, which is the whole premise of a, uh, a swimming cap. A shower bonnet is not a swim cap. I would not recommend it under any circumstances to use as a swim cap. Now you can certainly put it on your hair if you're at a pool and you don't plan on going in the water, but if at any point you plan on going in the water, a shower bonnet is not the bonnet for you. Okay, and we don't make swim caps. I um, I do have one I recommend, but I'm not going to mention it here because I have not checked with the makers to see if they will be okay with that. So, but in the, if they do in the future and I get more questions, I'll be sure to mention it in the future. Or you can send me a direct message and I'm sure I'll be more than happy to share that with you. Um, are shower caps reusable? Now, this is primarily what a lot of people have and use 
These are not good for our environment, okay? They they might be used, like I think the most you can get from something like this is maybe three or four uses and you're done, okay? Um, and it, it's made with plastic and plastic is not very good for our environment. As a matter of fact, a lot, a lot of it end up in the water, which is not eco-friendly. Now, this is our shower bonnet. And as you can see, yes, it's colorful because printed, um, you should know by it from our name. It's all about printed fabrics and beautiful colored fabrics. Anyways, so this is eco-friendly. Um, it's made with an eco-friendly method and it is 100% reusable. So you will get uh, a 400 plus showers out of this. The shower bonnet I currently have, I have had for well over three years. I haven't even had to change anything. Um, so that brings me to my next question. Can you wash your shower bonnet? Would you ever put this in the wash? No, because it would get ruined. This, absolutely, yes you can. Um, you can put it in a laundry bag. So I recommend because you want to do it delicately, you can either put it in a laundry bag and throw it in the wash, or you can also hand wash it by spot cleaning it if you feel that you have things inside of it that you just want to clean. Um, it, and also the other thing is it's great, it's soft, and the elastic is encased, which makes it easier, like it, it, it uh, prevents the potential for having um, mold and things built on the elastic. So unlike this, I'm sure if you've used enough of these, you've seen that it has mold over time and then you eventually have to toss it because the elasticity is gone. This here you get to wear for a lot longer. And the last and not, but not the least question I've received is, are shower caps good for your hair? Absolutely. Um, one, uh, a lot of times people don't wash their hair on a daily basis. They wash it maybe once a week or once every few days. A shower cap is a great way to not over moisturize your hair. Water is great moisture for the hair. I am a huge advocate of it, but I'm also a huge advocate of drinking water um, instead of, you know, just putting water in your hair. So when you drink water, you get, um, you're able to get the the, the water, you know, the uh, the hi hydration you need. <laughs> so um, wearing a shower cap is a way to not only get the water inside internally and keep your hair, because basically your hair grows out of your head, right? So um, you're nourishing it from the inside out. You don't necessarily need to have then, you know, pour water on it because basically all you're wetting at this point is hair that's already grown out of your scalp. You want to make sure that you're taking care of yourself on the inside so that when you wear your shower cap at some point when you need to, you know, when you don't have to wash your hair, your hair is still moisturized as it's coming out of your head as it grows out. So anyways, those are some of the major questions we've received. Um, feel free to send me any other questions. I will go over it during one of these sessions. I love to interact with you guys. So if you haven't done so, take a moment to visit our sites at www.printedbonnet.com. If you want to send an email, you have questions, that is info at uh, printedbonnet.com. Um, always very responsive. And thank you again for taking the time to listen to me. Have a wonderful day.